I'm John Grimm. I teach at the Yale School of Forestry and Environmental Studies. And I'm Mary Evelyn Tucker, and I also teach there in a program on world religions and ecology. And also we have uh, one leg at Yale Divinity School, which also has solar panels. And so does the School of Forestry and Environmental Studies have a new green building with huge solar panels. So, right. And we wanted to say a word about why we put solar panels on the roof and how excited we are. We are interested in responding to the issue of our times, namely diminishing our carbon footprint and diminishing the use of energy, and solar panels is a great way to start on reducing our own use of energy. It's been a very exciting process. Uh, this company, Be Free, Green Energy, has been absolutely terrific. They really know what they're doing. That's they're on right. top of things. They've gotten all the permits very, very well, and they installed it themselves extremely efficiently in uh, two days, working very, very hard and steadily. So we were very pleased. Yes, and one of the innovations that's on this roof, which really makes it possible, I'm not sure if you can see by camera, but uh, it's a heavily forested setting in Connecticut. And I contacted five solar companies, three of them, Google Earth uh, our home, and wouldn't even come. You're not candidates, they said, it's too shady. Be Free Green Energy not only came, but they read the solar possibilities for the year so that we could literally see what was here, what could be done with some trimming of trees, no topping of trees. We did take down some trees that were hollow, so it made it a little bit better. But we are in a shady location, so we were not after the biggest financial bite. We were after this, uh, this possibility here of what could be done. And so, Instead of the arrangement of a series of panels in which if one is shaded, they all lose power or they're all diminished, we now have end-phase inverters so that every panel is independently producing energy. It makes it possible in this shaded part of the world that if one panel is shaded, the others are up to snuff. It's a very exciting process, uh, the notion of generating energy, reducing one's footprint, carbon footprint, energy footprint is, I think, a terrific feeling. And uh, we're very committed to this um, principle, um, as well as the, the larger direction that our planet is moving in. I think this has um, been an extraordinary experience, and we're really delighted with it. And I just want to second again the work of Be Free Green Energy. The work is without parallel, non-parallel. They really know their stuff. They really do good work. Thank mm -hmm. you.